Hi, here we are for the Euromel Express show at the uh, Exeter Tattoo Convention. It's sponsored by who you know more about Santa than me. Who's it sponsored by? Sponsored by? Twisted Ink. Twisted Ink is the name of the convention. Yeah. Um, it's been organised by um, a load of uni students who had to put on an event and they chose a tattoo convention, which is a fantastic idea. And for those who are wondering who I'm with, I'm with Anthony. Does well, we know what he does for our show, but uh, yes, he does. He's uh, he's the main guy at the Tatorium Inc. Captain's Tatorium Tattoo Shop in Exeter. How are you doing? I'm doing very well, yeah. thanks. The day has been brilliant so far. So far, it looks very busy, but it's a very small venue, I think. Yeah, what it is. We're everyone's struggling to get around, I think. I think the issue is, um, because they're trying to cram. The tattooists in, vendors, hairdressers, all this sort of thing. Mm. They've been limited for space. I think the hope is that it goes really well this time. Next time, we can use more of the Phoenix. Yeah. We can, because there's upstairs and all this sort of stuff. We can use more area to get more tattooists in, more people involved, more local vendors, more local bands. That's what we're trying to do, really. Definitely, I think, because at the moment, everyone's sort of getting in each other's way and all that. Mm. So, uh, you're tattooing one particular guy today, are you? Is yeah, I'm tattooing doing? one chap called James Parker, who's a lovely bloke, and um, I'm doing his, I'm tattooing his back primarily for about four hours. Whoa, that's a lot of, uh, <laughs> a lot of time on tattooing. And that's all you're doing? And that's like all said, I'm that's doing tattoo-wise, yeah. And we know about the history about when you started tattooing, so we don't need to cover it or all that. Is this the first tattoo convention you've ever done before? No, I've done several before. I've done London Tattoo Convention. Um, well, I've been to Mantra, Cheltenham Racecourse, uh, Newport, I believe, was the other one, and Plymouth. So I've done a few, and I've been to more than that as just an observer, as a punter. Dare and I've actually I worked. What, dare I ask what Plymouth's tattoo convention is like? Is it big? Plymouth Tattoo Convention was actually pretty good. It was over three floors. It was kind of huge, <laughs> but it was, it, you know, it wasn't the first one. They're, they're well established. Oh, they've got a lot more, and they had various tattoo magazines and stuff involved, which we don't have here yet because it's the first one. It's got to start somewhere. Do you know why? Do you, do you know why Exeter has only just started now? I don't know. I just don't think in the capital as well. I don't think anyone's got round to to actually organising it. Really, I, I do think it's something that's worthwhile we've been really busy today i think they've had more people through than we thought they've already i think they've already made all their money back anyway so so it's good so, it's good. so they've covered all the costs so i think next year we'll have a bigger one and a better one and we'll have bands as well they this about, evening yeah yes bands this evening um i believe i divide a headlining they play download yeah yeah i divide um yeah. and I, I can't remember the names of the others because i can't <laughs> no, i i just know i divide yeah. who uh, were on da uh, download yeah. last year yeah. and uh, i think that's the most famous band yeah. that's i think, I think the rest time. of them are all really local local yeah, yeah. which i think but is I divide from this area yeah they are sure, yeah. Yeah. So, um, you got any plans to do any more conventions? Um, I'll definitely do this one again if it happens again, and I hope it does, mm -hmm. fingers crossed. Um, but I, local ones are fine for me, but to be honest, dragging myself here and there all over the place is a bit of a pain. Um, I'm, 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 yeah, well, it does. I'm, I was working yesterday till six. I'm working tomorrow from uh, half nine. So I've got to come in here, mm. do the convention, tidy up, get back, come back for the evening, and then I'm working tomorrow. So, you know, it's quite a feels in quite a weekend really there you go but it does pay the bills doesn't it it so, does yeah, i'm yeah. not going to complain too much anyway he's short but sweet but we are Shame. trying to cram in as many people as we possibly can that's we're going to obviously have you back that's a fine because i'll come on the show of course <laughs> yes because yes. you know you're yes yes like, so well, yes hey. but uh yeah so thanks for this little short very outburst interview and we're going to move on to the next one okay no worries thanks okay so much. right cheers bye <laughs>